Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim Assalamu Alaikum Welcome back viewers in the previous video we were just seeing the demonstration of this task uh, how this works on 8 mega 16 now in this video we are just going to the source code and explanation of the registers used in this uh, source code for the uh, for the uh, microcontroller uh, 8 mega 16 I'm using software for the compiling of the source code is AVR Studio 5.1 including header files in the beginnings and then uh, initializing the global variable in the beginning. Following are the registers used in our source code sreg, adcsra, admux and ddr. sreg register is used for enabling the global interrupt. The ADC SR register is used to enable the ADCs and setting the prescaler and the method how you want to use the ADCs. ADC SR register is also known as ADC control and status register. How this, uh, what are the purpose of these all bits? Now I am trying, uh, trying to explain this. Here are the bits from 0 to 7 the bit 7 is used to finally enable the ADC and then the bit 6 is used to start the conversion means when the voltage is changed at the pin uh, the channel you are using it might be 0 to 7 any channel then uh, when we set this bit to 1 the conversion will be started the, the pin 5 is the auto trigger enable the pin 4 is the ADC interrupt flag and the pin 3 is ADC in interrupt enable in this task we are solving this by using the pin number 3 the interrupt enable because I have used the interrupts in this task the last three bits leads us to the combinations to some prescaler as described in this table the 00 we cannot use three in this combination of this three bit because it is reserved and the remaining combinations leads to this prescaler. The prescaler we use 2, 4, 8, and 16, 32, 64, 128 uh, is depending on your calculations. This prescaler affects the calculation speed of a your microcontroller uh, from converting to the uh, analog voltage to a digital value. Prescaler used in this task is 64 because we do not want the speed of the conversion just we want is the exact conversion the you can say the best conversion answer our next register is at max this register also known as multiplexer selection register here is the description the 7 bits of admux the combination of these two bits for the selection of the reference voltage and is the adlar bit and these 5 bits for the selection of your channel from where you want to convert the analog voltage into digital means where you have just connected the your potentiometer or where you have connected the analog sensor I have just used the AVCC with external capacitor at a reference mean I just used the combination of 0 to 1 uh, at the pin number 7 and pin 6. And here is the most important register in the ADC. It is ADL also known as ADLAW register. If we set this register to 0 mean we have just tried adjusted and equals to 1 means left adjusted. We in most cases we use adlar is equal to 1 because the maximum of our data is stored in the register ADCH and if we just so if we just clear the adlar bit to 0 then our maximum data will be stored in the uh, ADCL register but uh, ADCH registers has some of the value this will just interpolate our data and we will lose the maximum significant bits if we just set the bit at large bit then we will just having our maximum data stored in ADCH 
we will just only having two remaining bits storing in ADCL. This this means we will just having the answer uh, with the tolerance of plus minus four or uh, two, uh, from which we can tolerate or we can accept our converted answer. I, here I have just uses the left adjusted of a log and here is a combination reference voltage is set and the left sheet and channel 0 the main thing is just to select the channel where you want to start the conversion in this task channel 0 must be selected and here is the combination from where we have to select the Here is the combination of 5 bits to select the channel 0 of the multiplexer. Here you can see these 5 bits must have the combination to follow the channel. Here I am using this combination to select the channel 0 as it is given in the task. If you want to change the channel, just follow this combination and we will be having the selection of this channel 0, 1 to any 7. The register DDR is a data direction reg register. Just we are in initializing this FF, so the port B, C, and D must be initialized as the output. Means we are just sending values from the port D to some output. Now I have just set this bit 6 to 1. Means I am just doing what here is just doing or operation with this what does this means means any value assigned to the ADC SR register will not change but the bit number six it is one or zero what's the value it was given before but now it will be replaced with one means the conversion has just started the con conversion has started means when the voltage change will be observed, observed at the pin uh, 0 or just uh, channel 0 the voltage change observed at the channel 0 will be given an interrupt the array initialized has three rows and in this case I have just used these three rows to show the difference of uh, storing uh, data for the port B and for the port C and the for, uh, for the port uh, D as we know the index start, pro of, uh, start from the 0 to 1 and 2 means when the interrupt will be received means the conversion has started the value ADC H will have the converted converted value I'll store this value into the array. Now I have to make three different rows for the differentiation of the my ports because according to the task I have to show three different values on three different ports. When the value changes, the port must be changed. Now, if the if the ADC value is less than uh, 99, which is 63 to 0. 63 in uh, hex code uh, then the ADH value will be stored on per, uh, row 0 and it will be displayed on the port B if the value is greater than 99 in, in hex it is greater than 64 uh, then the value will be stored in the row 1 and, uh, and if the value is greater than uh, 199 mean in hex code and greater than C7 then the value will be stored in the third row when the interpret received this will be doing again and again and again again and again and here in the last operation uh, when the conversion has done we have to set again the bit 6 to 1 so it will again start the conversion uh, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0 or uh, uh, 4 0 in hex is, uh, is means that we are just setting the bit 6 to 1 to again start the conversion the while loop it will remain in the while while loop showing the value stored in the arrays so our data will be updated when the interrupt comes and the conversion will be started thank you very much please like comment and share